Hello, this is Tambra Moser, the Director of Instructional Design, with some really great news. We have recently upgraded our Moodle, and so it's going to look a little bit different for you. And I'm here to just give you a little tour to show you what's new. I'm not going to go into too much depth later on as we get to using some of these new tools. I will provide you with additional information and training on that. But as you can see right off the bat, it looks different. The icons are different. And also the blocks look a little different. And there's more stuff in them too. One of the great things that's new now is that you can hide and expand by clicking the little plus and minus you can expand and hide the things that are in the blocks which is nice. You also see that there are some additional tools here with this new navigation block you can go to I'm right now in the course template course which is just blank it has just some it's a template but as you can see over here now with this course template I can expand this I can see all the stuff from week one right there, 8 August to 14 August. I can see everything that's in there. I can go directly to it without having to scroll all the way down. Maybe I wanted to go to week 8 and go to the 8.1 discussion forum and it'll take me right there. So this is nice. Also, as you see all of my courses that I'm involved with, I can also access my profile from here and you can see that there's there's more stuff so I'm going to encourage you to go ahead and explore and see all of the new things and if you have specific information or specific questions or like information about some of these things please let me know course settings looks a little different we got the administration a couple of new tools, outcomes, backup, re reset, which is nice, question bank, personalized learning designer. I'm getting to know this tool myself and <laughs> there's some really great things that it can do. I'm not going to go into details now, but in the future I will let you know what I find out about this personalized learning designer. Also, I can switch, as an administrator, I can switch my role to just about anything. I can go to my profile settings, edit my profile, search events, and on the right hand block pretty much the same courses available to you and messages and latest news. Here's something that's new. You're going to like this. Over here move this to the dock. So I'm going to click on it and now it's over here in my docking station and I can actually go ahead and click all of these and all of a sudden I've got a wider view here. Now if I want these back I can click them one at a time and put it back into the right, uh, left hand panel or if I want them all back I can undock all and they all go back into the panel. Same is true over here. So I can click these and go all the way over here. Click that all the way over here. Want them back? Click. Click. And they go back to the panels. So that's new. Let's see if there's anything else down here. No, that's pretty much what we've got there. So it looks different. I'm going to turn editing on. You're going to see that our editing tools look different as well. And there you have it. We have, this is the edit button, left and right. You can come down here and see left and right. This is the move tool and it's supposed to drag and drop We've got a little bit of a glitch happening right here, so if it's not working as it's supposed to, don't worry about it. 
uh, we've got contact with Moodle to get that to work the way it's supposed to because right now it's it works exactly the way that it did before I click on it and it's going to give me all the boxes see and then I click on the box where I want it to be and it's back where it was the new move tool is supposed to be drag and drop just click it and drag it to wherever you want it to be again here's the edit also known as update this is duplicate which is nice you press this and it duplicates this particular form so no more having to write it again and again and again which is nice for the labels this is delete this is our eyeball the hide show this is new groups so you can group now this is groups are in the quizzes and the discussion forums yeah discussion forums chat rooms that way you can group your students into smaller groups that their assign roles don't worry about this one for now so at the end personalized learning designer which is new and you can go ahead and explore if you like I encourage you to do that since this is new the instructional design team is also learning how to use some of these new tools and as soon as we know how they work we will definitely let you know how they work as well so you're probably wondering what the grade book looks like so we're going to come over here to grades and the biggest thing that I see that is different in the grade book is this new slider oh yeah before when you scrolled over you didn't it didn't keep the the students so there you go that one slides over now categories and items looks pretty much the same it does have all the new tools of course but pretty much it's the same as it was you can pull down the aggregation you can look at the full view preferences and settings and everything is all the same so there you have it quick tour of the new and improved Moodle it's coming to you very very soon if not already <laughs> in some cases if you have any questions if you are a member of the Georgia Military College online campus faculty please contact me Tambra Moser T M O S E R at gmc.cc.ga.us if you are in a faculty member for one of the DLCs or you work from Millensville in any teach in seat oh no I do not want to change my scheme <laughs> so you would want to contact Kelly Weems at K W E E M S at gmc.cc.ga.us. And we will be very happy to take care of you the best we can. And good luck. Until the next time, this is Tamper Moser signing off.